Hey everyone, welcome back to Daily Downshift. Recently, one of the biggest Corvette dealerships named Kerbeck posted their entire order specs on their website for the public to see. Lots of very useful information came out of this for anyone interested in analyzing the data. And that's exactly what the people over at Corvette Blogger did, and it yielded some very interesting results. Someone was bound to do this eventually simply because the dealership offered so much concrete information in regards to the vehicle like the trim level, the paint color, the build date, the status code, and most importantly, the full build price of each and every vehicle ordered at the dealership. This is priceless information, especially because there's a total of 240 orders, making this a relatively large sample size that we can then deduce and figure out what people are liking and what they're not ordering. Now before we go ahead and spoil the results, take a second to guess what you think is going to be the most popular color ordered at this dealership for the Corvette C8. I personally wasn't very surprised with the number one choice, but everything after that definitely shocked me. So here we go. From top to bottom, in first place, we have Torch Red with 25% of customers choosing this color. That's one fourth, which is actually quite a lot. This is an iconic Corvette color, so this one makes a lot of sense to me. Next up, we have Arctic White at 12.5% in second place and Elkhart Lake Blue in third place with 10.8%. These two colors surprise me a ton on because they're not especially flashy or special but they're very solid base colors that look good with a lot of different options in different lighting tied for fourth and fifth place we have ceramic gray and black both at 8.8 percent this one was also a shocker to me because i'm personally not a big fan of ceramic gray at all and i think the black isn't anything special either we then have shadow gray metallic at 7.1 percent orange at 6.7 percent blade silver at 5.8 percent rapid blue at 5.8 percent as well long beach red at 3.8 accelerate yellow at 3.3 percent and finally and last place we have zeus bronze with only 1.7 percent of total orders that means that only two customers out of 250 ordered this color very very low and it seems like not a lot of people are interested in this specific color so right off the bat i'm going to say that the biggest surprise for me was shadow gray metallic being so high up the standings from the various photos i've seen in different lighting conditions this is the one color that just looks so basic and bland to me in my opinion this color is just very boring and looks like something you'd see on an everyday pickup truck then again i am a younger buyer so my tastes are probably very different from the older crowd uh, which are likely buying these vehicles in this specific color i was also very surprised that orange and rapid blue weren't higher up the list as they're very flashy new colors that most younger people are really going to like from what i've seen thus far Maybe Corvette hasn't been able to capture the younger crowd as much as they would have liked, but that's fine because once these get out in the streets, everybody will see them and start getting more attracted to them. Blade Silver is another color that I really enjoy and it makes the body lines of the Corvette really pop. It's probably my favorite neutral color out of all of the options. Lastly, I think it's important to talk about the worst three performing colors and this is something that I actually predicted pretty perfectly. It's no surprise that Zeus Bronze is dead last as it is bland and looks pretty outdated. Accelerate Yellow is not far in front in second to last place as the shade of yellow really isn't what people hoped for when they imagined imagined a yellow mid-engine Corvette. It definitely disappointed quite a lot of people. And then finally, in third to last place, we have Long Beach Red. Not as horrible as the other two colors as it has a little bit of classiness to it, but still not most people's first choices. So for those of you who do have a C8 on order, please do let me know which color you chose and whether or not you're surprised by this list. I personally have a Sebring Orange on order, so this was a little bit shocking to me that more people didn't choose Orange because I saw it in person and it pops just so well and looks great in different lighting conditions. Next, we can talk a little bit about the trim levels, but there's not a whole lot that we can take from this information because of constraints and order priority in the first couple of months. Months. Of the 240 orders that Quebec had, 3LT trims made up 45.4% of the orders, while 2LT made up 42.9%. Of course, that leaves the 1LT with only 11.7% 
of the orders. Now, this spread will definitely change as constraints have now been lifted, and in the future, buyers that weren't as hyped about the vehicle will opt for cheaper models closer to the base price to get the best performance without breaking the bank. Speaking about money, the average price of a Corvette CA ordered through Quebec was a whopping $79,275, which doesn't even include taxes. Now, for my Canadian friends out there, the exchange rate would equate to $103,000 Canadian dollars. Wow, okay, that's that's a lot of money for a Corvette C8. But anyways, it is an awesome car, so I'm not surprised people are fully loading these out and trying to get, uh, you know, as much as possible out of this vehicle. But that's really going to do it for the video, though, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me know what you think of the color options people are choosing, the average price point that people are at with Quebec, and also let me know what you think of the trim levels and all of that good stuff. So that's going to do it for the video, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. If you're new around here, make sure to subscribe. We do have a Corvette C8 on order, and it will be coming spring 2020. Uh, so we're going to be pumping out lots of Corvette C8 content. Drop a like on the video if you guys enjoyed it, and we will see you all in the next one. Peace.